Good morning, this is Irina. Welcome to my art studio and to another journal sale. Oh, <laughs> it breaks my heart, but also I, I just have too many, you know, and um, I, I hoard them. However, I will not talk too much about it <laughs> so I don't get upset. I want them to find a new home. But it's hard for me to, you know, give them away, if that makes sense. I think it makes sense to you if you make journals. It's about um, five and three quarters by um, nine and a half. And I don't even know, do we have anything straight here? <laughs> three and a half-ish spine. It's a big baby. It's a big baby. This one is a big journal, big journal look at this it's amazing I love it so this one is made not with signatures but with um, cardstock pages you see there is no sewn in signatures this is all glued into the spine and it makes it movable and um, you say I don't know if you can tell I think I even made this with you I might have made this with I probably did so in my playlists, um, making journals, there must be this one. I don't name my journals. I don't know <laughs> if everybody seems to do so, but my journals are just like, you know, whatever it turns out to be. This is the back. It's just very simple. And um, I put some fabric on the spine and there will be um, threads and stuff, you know, hanging because I'm a fan of this. You know, I'm a fan of things just being there. So yeah, sometimes they get tangled up a little bit. So just be aware of that. I want you to know everything about the journal before you buy it. So this might be something you don't like. So I just want this to go to somebody who will um, really love it. I need to know that it's loved. Okay, this is the front and it's very simple closure here for this. It's just we can we can um, change it or you can change it. Let me open this up. There, you know, I left it without anything. So if you want to put something different on here, because there are holes, I did not tie it or do anything. You can just take it out, you know, because some sometimes we like to do something of our own to the journals, right? So there's threads all over. Okay, it opens up. It has like a little tuck spot in here. And then here on the bottom, it has a little pocket and it opens up as well. And then you get this that opens up and here you could put this journal belongs to whatever. And this is a pocket right here and you can take the card out and you can exchange it. Jesus, it's too big for me to move my hands like that. And when I'm sitting down, yeah, right here, it's just a card and you can exchange it for whatever you want to put in there, okay? So if I put something back in, I'm going to pause you because it's hard on my hands and I don't want you to see that. <laughs> it's not, not my best day. Okay, and then you can just tie it once again and it will be closed. It has, this is all stuck so you cannot untie it. It's just a decoration. Okay, now all is closed. Let's move on to this one. This has a closure. Um, you see, there are like these little metal pieces that you get with your eyelids. And I never know how to use them. So I put them right here on my strings. <laughs> so you just open it up. And this one, I believe this one is just... No, this one, you... Well, you could exchange it if you wanted to. No, I don't think so. I think this... This must stay. <laughs> okay, so it opens up like this and it has stuff hanging down and this is a picture frame. I have actually a flip through of this journal, so I don't know, like, it feels weird to do it once again, but um, like I said, this time is for sale and my information is in the description. Please email me, you know, I'll ship anywhere and, um, but shipping is extra. And shipping is very expensive, I think, international. So just be aware of that because it's heavy, you know, it's it's heavy. So it opens like this and you can write here or you can open up here and then it has a big pocket and a small pocket right here you could write on. It has writing spots because it has pages that are blank in between like this. 
can say you could write you could write on anything right you can write on a tag or on those little pieces and there is like oh, heart i have this one in here it's like another writing spot for you and um these are little things that you can take out and write something tiny on it and you know this is just this is the slot thing and then this one has another tag in it as well um i didn't go through this journal in a while so i might miss a pocket or two and then you will discover it someday i'm trying to figure out how it works <laughs> just with it oh wait no this tag see i just pushed it in the back but i'm pretty sure that this tag this is a pocket yep this is a pocket so this goes into the pocket let me push it in it's not too hard to push in and out it's just for me with my hands it's a little complicated sometimes okay wait we have to close everything up so it stays in place another pocket here and then another writing page and then these open up and you can write in them and they also open up like this and you could write here and it has wait this one doesn't this is a tuck spot so you can put a lot of stuff in there and then write underneath and um, I love <laughs> closures and stuff <laughs> so I made this one so this doesn't you know move you open this up and then you can open this one up and there is pockets and pockets and pockets you know and pockets <laughs> and then you close it and then you just move this here and it stays kind of shut and then this is a big pocket those are envelopes as you can see right junk mail envelopes and every junk mail envelope has something in it and this one is a pocket too for a very long strip of whatever you want to put in there but i put a piece for you in there already and it has this flower and i like for them to look through the windows another slot i connected two of them so it's kind of longer and you have two cards, but you can stick as many as you want. I made booklets throughout. they not really booklets, but they look like this. And those are envelopes as well. So you can just hang it in there or on it, you know. And then when you take it out, you can actually flip it. And you have another writing spot. And I put a piece of paper so the bird looks through. And the piece of paper you can take out as well and write on this one as well. And this opens up. And is another pocket right there and then more writing spaces little tags little pockets i coffee dyed all the papers you know there are a couple principles i believe they might be from eva from bohemian crafting you know and this is um her style journal so i she taught me basically how to do that oh look another thread <laughs> yeah so there is some flips and more pockets with stuff and then that's this flips out and there is two cards in there this is like a big pocket as well here and then you turn it i made one of these with my with my tag it's too big it's too big i have to turn it around here dreaming of flowers and it has another little piece in the back you can take out and journal this has a lot of journaling spots i can tell I forgot already what I did here, you know, it's it's cool. <laughs> and this is just a bag, you know, you could put something in there, but I just, for me, it was just decorative with another pocket and then another envelope here with another booklet like that. And then something looking through the envelope and then you put the booklet on there and then you put the bag and tag on there. So it basically decorates it a little bit as well. Um, wait, I think this we can undo. Let me undo this one. I think, yep. So this is extra. You can take it out. You can write here. And then I just clipped a picture on top and the forever thing. And then there's writable spots and tuck spots and the pocket right here. This is an envelope as well. So uh, I think I want to make more of these. <laughs> I should make more of these before before it's sold because I don't think I have it in my book of ideas. Okay, and then I clipped it. Let me see. Those little paper clips are sometimes tricky. I'm going to clip it right on here. 
okay are we good we're good another one of the opening things and then you open up and you can journal i don't want this video to be too long i'm trying to get quicker you know this attack spot you can take it out just the same thing as we had before um this one opens up and then you can write on it and it's also a pocket and this one is a pocket with my little magic cart in there that i made love it i love some magic in my journals another envelope where I put a tag in so this can look through and then this you can open up and write on it this one comes out and you can open up and write on it as much as you want and this one comes out you can write on it this is another envelope right here and I just hang it into the envelope and um, the envelope has a tag you, you see there's all uh, like threads and stuff throughout there's something hanging everywhere <laughs> because I enjoy this and I used like tape that I made to look old you know and then there's another one of these flips but then you have to take out this are two pockets like one pocket and another pocket in the back but you have to take them out to be able to open this up okay so and then you can stick them back in in their pockets and this is a flip too you know I used metal I, I use so much stuff another tuck spot right here with my pretty paper <laughs> And then I have like from envelopes I made another booklet here and it has pockets and some writing spot and pockets and more writing spots here with tags in them more throughout there's like a couple pages that are completely blank as you can tell it's just maybe like a decorative page or whatever but another flip out which you cannot open you have to take this out and then you open it up and then you have a card right here in a pocket and then you can just push this one back in and it holds it basically shut and this one you have to undo oh, too big i cannot straighten my arms today and my hands and oh goody just as always right <laughs> you can undo it's made from a junk mail envelope and then you get this which you can exchange here you can take it out oh, 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 oh. Or did I glue it? I'm not quite sure. I think you should be able to take it out. I don't want to destroy it. Yeah, you can take it out. You can push your own picture or whatever right in there. Okay, now everything's inside. And this is just, you know, you open up and you have two big pockets. Same thing on this side. You can open it up and then there is another pocket. Wow, sometimes I feel like the hands don't belong to me. <laughs> Okay, you close it off and you put it back in and then you have to tie it and there's threads Yeah, so if you love threads, this might be something for you <laughs> Because I love them. I love them so much. I love everything that hangs somewhere and you know, like I just it's my This one is closed off. You can open it up easily like this and I'm pretty sure this is exchangeable as well Yep, it is and it's just a little tag and and a pocket with a window right here how did it work oh then you open it up and you can actually you know move it <laughs> so that's a little magic as well but if you don't want to move it you can flip it <laughs> and there is another one from this booklet this is a pocket see there is stuff in there and um i call them booklets i don't know they are really just flip outs or something i don't know I don't know all the words that you need to use and then you just put this in here and it holds it shut and this is made from a junk mail envelope again and you can just you know stick stuff in there where is it connected I'm trying to figure out I forget myself already okay what is this oh this was the booklet then here is a big pocket if you wanted to use it I don't know if you should <laughs> you know you can stick something in but it's very tight because the booklet is glued on this part and then there's another one of these flip outs this one is um, double-sided so basically I made a card I glued two together so you can see them and there is stuff hanging from it and this flips out as well once again a big card and a big pocket here and some tags and smaller pockets more writing spots and flips and just decorations and more papers to write on and more pockets more papers this one now and this is the thing this needs to be like carefully 
<laughs> this needs to come out carefully. It comes out from both sides, but it needs to be done carefully. I was um, considering exchanging this part. And um, if you buy it and you don't like it, I can take it off and put something different on it. But I really like it. It looks good. And um, it has like a pocket here. The only thing is if you pull, pull it, you have to pull from both sides. And then you can write on it and then you push it back in from both sides. You know, I don't want it to rip on you or something. So I would do both sides like this and then stick it back in like this. And then it works. So just so you know, I want you to know everything about the journal and not have any surprises. Look, book number and year, I was going <laughs> to write the year and um, write my, um, put my signature in here. If you don't want it and you bought it, please tell me so I don't do so. <laughs> if you don't want to know that it was mine, please tell me and I won't. I have one of these cards. It's just purely decorational on here. And one of my envelopes, junk mail envelopes that open up like this. I don't think there is anywhere a pocket in the back. Nope. And then goody, tiny little paper clip here. It's just purely decorational. And I have another, this is a paper clip, I believe. I believe so. Let's see. I, oh, yep, it is. You see, you can take it off. With paper clips like that, that are highly decorated, <laughs> you have to open them up a little bit before you stick them onto something so it doesn't, you know, fold on itself. And I do have a card right here that, oh yeah, opens up like that and you have flowers. <laughs> Yes, yes, I love it. I love a little magic. And I put the flower here so you can see it through this window. Okay, this one holds this one, you see. And it's just paper clipped. I can take it off and I can take out the little tag here. I can push it back in and then this one is just, it opens up like that. It has a pocket here. Junk mail envelope once again, right? So... You can tell <laughs> a lot of junk mail envelopes went <laughs> into this one. <laughs> it doesn't have to be held, but I, I just put it here, you know, because that's what I like. And that's what I thought was pretty. And this is another pocket here with another card for you, you know. And um, this one of my, I forget, but it's a tuck spot, okay? It's just leftover paper scraps. And then this one, once again, it has magic, but you have to be careful with magic because it's all paper, right? So please put it straight, pull it gently, not too far, push it back in and it's good. I don't want, I love the journals and that's why, you know, uh, when I show them to my daughter or something and she wants to pull them, like, careful, careful. I'm so concerned about my journals. I, know. I know it's silly, but it's just paper. Just remember that everything is paper, or almost everything is paper, so it will rip if you are not gentle. You have to be gentle with your journals. I am gentle with my journals. Another flip, and there is the same thing. Card can come out, and this flips out, and this comes out. It's a big pocket right here. You can stick whatever you want to stick in there. And yeah. Oh, there's another card even in the back, I think. Yep, there's two cards in there. Let's see. Yep, two. Okay. So there is that. And then, I don't know about you, but I always have my little truck. I put my crocodile on top so I can tie it again. Um. Yeah, my heart is heavy again, but hey, you know, sometimes I... Um, I will film a video to sell a journal and I will never post it. And once I filmed a video for a journal and I posted it and it wasn't sold in a day. So next day I just took the video down because I was like, nope, not selling it anymore. <laughs> so it happens. But I really am determined because I think it will give them a new home and it will give me a little more space to like create more and I only make maybe two journals in a year 
you know i'm not like this journal maker every month or like every two weeks or whatever it takes me a long time it takes me takes me many months to create a journal so yeah please email me um i would say please email me with your best offer and we will go from there but um my journals are not cheap i don't sell them for cheap so just so you know and um my email is in the description. Um, I will tell you how much are you. Send me an offer. Send me an offer and we will see, you know. That works too. And shipping will be extra. And it's kind of heavy. So I don't know how much shipping is going to be. I, I would assume here maybe something like if you want... Um, what was my last shipping? I think $11 or something. But it had... Um, what is it called? Insurance. So if you want it insured, it will be a little bit more. And yeah, please only, only buy it if you want to love it. <laughs> please don't buy it if, if you like, uh, I'm just going to throw it somewhere in the corner. <laughs> so please. <laughs> yeah, <clears throat> I also don't sell um, to anybody. If I don't have a good feeling, I won't sell. Just so you know, it's nothing against you. It's just for me personally, because uh, yeah. I need to know or have a good feeling that this journal will be loved. All right. Email in the description. And um, yeah, thank you very much for watching. And I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope it goes to a good home. So I hope you guys are all healthy and happy and having a good day. And I will see you soon. Bye-bye.